Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 6th, which I believe is also the new moon. So we're just going to see what comes up. Um, I think that we have somebody here that has made a choice. They have made a clear choice. Um, it probably has to do with walking away or going back to something. I feel like they've been in some sort of uh, confusion, but now they see there's been some sort of emotional disappointment. And uh, I feel like we have somebody here that's really been thinking. They've been thinking, you know, should I stay? Should I go? Exploring their options. What should I do? But now they've become clear with the Seven of Cups reverse. That's like some sort of clarity. I know what I have to do. You know, this is like making a clear choice. Okay, so somebody is making a, a clear choice as to, you know, where their happiness is. It's interesting because Seven of Cups and Eight of Cups, I just cut the deck. Eight of Cups reverse. It's like there's a progression here. So wait, there's progress. Somebody is about to make some sort of progress. They've been uh, probably struggling with a choice. The past, you know, thinking about the memories, thinking about the past. Um, grieving for quite some time, uh, confused, you know, probably while they were confused, they've been exploring their other options, but they didn't know which was the best way to go. But I feel like this is like a choice that is, is now being made. Ace of Wands reverse. So this is uh, being weighed down. It's going south. Something. This is. There's a lack of drive, lack of excitement, lack of growth. Not taking any action. Things aren't growing. There's no spark. Right. The Ace of Wands reverse is a lack of desire as well. So something is going south. There's no growth. There's. There's no passion for it. There's no desire. Six of Cups Reverse. So the Six of Cups Reverse is clinging to the memories of the past, holding on to the past. Somebody has weighed, been weighed down by the memories of the past. Um, they've let their past weigh them down, okay? And, it, and whatever their past is, you know, their past experiences are weighing somebody down. But this is freedom from obligation, the Six of Cups Reverse. It could be packing up, leaving home, leaving the past behind. Maybe there's no desire to go back to the past anymore. But there, the past is definitely weighing somebody down. The past memories, the past experiences. King of Wands. So King of Wands could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This is somebody that is very decisive, that is prob given to take action. So somebody is about to take action. Uh, this It looks like it's very, somebody's not happy. I feel like we have somebody that really, really, really isn't happy. They're not seeing any growth. They're not seeing any... Uh, Well, there's no spark. There's there's a lack of ambition. There's a lack of drive. We are having somebody here that's not, they're being weighed down. They, maybe they're repeating their past over and over and over again. This King of Wands is about to take action. This person does not look happy at all. They may have lost an opportunity, you know, with that Ace of Wands reversed. King of Cups, King of Cups, acting on feelings. Somebody is going to be acting on their feelings. Mm -hmm. 
somebody may be leaving their past behind as well. It's like, you know, I have a big, this is a big hearted individual. We have a very big hearted, somebody's going to be following their heart, taking the lead, taking, taking charge. I feel like we have somebody here that is about to do something from their heart. Well, that makes sense okay so the empress we have the empress here this is a woman of value this is a uh, beautiful domestic goddess that grows things that is a creator this is a creator uh, this is somebody who creates life so it may have something to do with a mother or a could also be dealing with a Taurus or a Virgo <laughs> I don't know why I said Virgo Taurus, Virgo, it what could, must be, has something to do with the Virgo. Libra, this is Taurus, Libra, but Virgo came out. Interesting. So, um, Empress. Empress is the goddess. She's the goddess of love. She's the pick of the litter. She's beautiful. She does everything with love. She's a creator. She creates life. Some, so this Empress, she has, I don't know, she has a couple of options. Mm -hmm could be one person though that is taking on both energies could be a cusp you know it could be like a water fire cusp you know it could this would be like an Aries Pisces um, Scorpio Sagittarius Cancer Leo we also have Taurus and Libra here. I did bring up Virgo. It doesn't matter who you are, but um, the Empress is the giver of life. She creates life. She's a domestic goddess. She knows her value. She is all queens in one. She always has multiple options anyway. This Empress is about to... It's a very fertile time. There's, she can grow things. She creates things. She has the skills. She has the ability to create life, okay? She does. She's a creator. She has the, well, it's the seed. Well, no, they have the seed, but she has the egg, right? She has the ability. She has the ability to create that new life. So this is about giving birth to a new life. We have somebody here that is about to be, they're about to receive an offer with that King of Cups right behind. They're about to receive an offer from somebody. This is somebody that has good intentions, that is gonna be acting on their feelings. This person has not, taking taken any action because they were clinging to the memories of the past or something like that anyway the empress is about to give birth okay or she's about to uh, you know this is the beginning oh. ace of cups reversed Page of Wands reversed and Seven of Swords reversed. So somebody's not happy. They may be in a unrequited love situation. Uh, Ace of Cups reversed. They're not happy. They're sad. There's tears. There's there's um, the deception. self-deception we have somebody here that has not planned effectively they have not they may have lost a love or they've lost an opportunity it's interesting because this is my second one and uh i decided not to use these cards but this one came up missed opportunity it's right on the top and i was like hmm, missed up somebody has missed an opportunity and i feel like and i feel like uh Sorry. I feel like they are um, they're coming back around with that seven of, seven of swords reversed. 
this is somebody that has missed an opportunity. And I do, it's somebody from the past, somebody that has a, it's probably a soulmate connection. Maybe somebody has been ignoring a soulmate connection. We have somebody here that is really in their feelings. They're in their feelings. They're feeling it in their heart. They may be angry and upset. You know, the Seven of Swords reverse is somebody that is needs to let go. They may be coming, becoming clean. You know, they've 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 been uh, unable to take action, maybe because of fear. Definitely not happy. We definitely have somebody here that really, really, really isn't happy with the Ace of Cups reversed. It's like a lost opportunity for love. And it's because this person didn't take action. They didn't take action. They they were um, not wanting the responsibility. You know, when you when you give yourself to another person, you have to accept the responsibility. It has something to do with commitment, right? Having a setback, bad news, bad news, bad news with it. This is like a page of the page of wands reverses bad news, not happy, not happy. Somebody may have uh, slipped away because this person didn't take action. They didn't take action. We definitely, with the, with the Knight of, or not the Knight, the Page of Wands reverse, that is somebody that has lost their focus, they've lost their drive, they may be very fearful of opening their heart, you know, somebody, we may have somebody here that is, has been turning a blind eye to what their heart wanted because they were so scared. I do believe that we have somebody here that has their um, their emotions are all over the place, and they may they may um, maybe they're suddenly going to be expressing their feelings because they it just there's there could be an outburst there could be an outburst here an emotional outburst. This Empress is going to be receiving an offer, obviously. We have commitment here. I knew it had to do with commitment, a proposal, you know, engagement. There's going to be an upcoming get together, or there could be an appropriate. Proposal, P -p 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 proposal. There could be a proposal. There could be a celebration, happiness, joy. You know, there's gonna, be, there is some sort of good news coming. There is. There is. We haven't. We have an individual that is about to uh, express their feelings. They may want to commit or they want to step the relationship up to the next level. There could be somebody that is stepping their relationship up to the next level. I do believe there is somebody that is coming back around. This person may have... Uh, slipped away you know they slipped away they didn't take any action they lost an opportunity for love and they're they're coming back around that's what I think this is there's something to do with the home here too and the empress she was this is a homemaker this is somebody that is very that really focuses on their home focuses on their family focuses on their children focuses on love
Seven of Wands reversed next to the Empress. That's admitting defeat. Done fighting. There is some competition here. We There is. I know that there is. I do believe this is like the end of a competition. This is somebody that is admitting their defeat. They are. It's like, okay, I give up. I give up. I give up. There is going to be a celebration. There is going to be a get-together. Six of Pentacles reverse. Somebody has lost something. They have. They have. I feel like they've lost something and now they want it back and now they want it back and I hate to say that but I feel like that's what this is. I feel like we have some, nothing stays the same. There's been no growth. There's about to be some because the the Empress, she's she grows things, okay? She can grow anything. She can make anything grow. This is somebody who nurtures. She nurtures things so that they grow. We also have somebody, well, I feel like we have somebody here that has lost their position. And now because they've lost their position, they're going to be taking action. You know what I'm saying? It's risky. It is very, very, very risky. This is definitely risky. We have somebody here that has been dishonest. They've been thinking negatively. Negatively. <laughs> I can't speak. I haven't been able to lately. Um, they've been thinking negatively. They have about about not listening to their heart, not following their heart. And they've been, you know, ignoring their feelings. They have. We also have some, we have somebody here that is hurting. They are really, really hurting. They're hurting. They're hurting. And I feel like they're hurting because they're not seeing any attention. They're not getting any attention from whoever it is that they have feelings for. not receiving but that six of pentacles reverse it's not receiving it's not receiving any attention by pushing somebody away somebody has it's like you, you they pushed somebody away and when you push people away i mean And I think because somebody was pushed away, you know, I mean, we have this Empress here. The Empress is the Queen of Value. She, she may be like, you know what? I have other options. We saw that with the Seven of Cups. There's other options. We do have somebody here that is coming back around. This is somebody that is following their heart, taking the lead. There could be a reunion here. They have not been living a, you know, there's a lack of passion, there's a, a, a lack of growth. They haven't been living it. It's like they haven't been happy at all in their current circumstances. And that's what's going to cause them to take. There's action that is definitely going to be taken. Admitting defeat, stepping down. I admit, I admit it. You win. It's like you win, you win, you win. I can't fight this anymore. I don't want to fight this anymore. I don't want to fight this anymore. I don't want to, or I don't want to fight anymore. I don't want to fight anymore. Magician reversed. I feel like we have somebody here that is 
sick of not having success. They want success. This is somebody who hasn't been able to obtain success because they haven't taken action. I feel like this person um, probably had no plan, probably had no plan of giving in. But I feel, I feel like there's a sudden change. I do feel like there is a sudden change here. Two of Swords reverse, making a decision. Somebody has been indecisive. They've been fighting, they've been fighting their own feelings. They've been blocking their emotions. They've been in mental turmoil. They've been unwilling to let go. They've had two options this whole time. They've had two options. Now, the decision is being made, and they are about to take action. They are. This is like somebody that is t getting a new vision. They're coming out of denial. They're seeing the truth. So we ha And I feel like we have somebody here that has missed. The magician reversed is, well, upright the magician is a golden opportunity. Reverse is missed a golden opportunity. This person has missed a golden opportunity because they were blocking their feelings. They were blocking their emotions. They were held back by fear in denial of their true feelings. But now, now it's like seeing very, very clearly what they want. And we get this reading a lot. This is the birth of a new life. The Empress gives birth, okay? This is a rebirth of something. We have an individual here that wants happiness you know they want to receive and they've been in a situation where they have not been receiving what they deserve coming out of denial making a choice i think it is extremely suddenly i just do Somebody's about to receive. I feel like it's very unexpected. I feel like it's unexpected, some sort of unexpected communication or an unexpected offer or an opportunity from somebody. It happens very suddenly. Somebody's going to be acting on their feelings. They probably received some bad advice, you know, that, that kept them where they were at. This person was definitely in denial of their feelings, but you know, you can't hide the feelings forever, right? Expressions. Somebody's going to be expressing expressing, you know, their feelings. They may be even making a proposal, could be a marriage proposal. I feel like there's a reunion here. I do. Three of Pentacles. This is communication, teamwork, working together. <clears throat> I do feel like we have had we have somebody that has went through a period of enlightenment. This per this person has been thinking, they have been thinking a lot thinking about their future, thinking about who they are, waiting for the right moment. But this person has also been sacrificing themselves needlessly.
I feel like we have somebody here that is about to prove something. It's like they're about to prove that, you know, they want to work together. They, they want to work together, that they want to work this out. After they have not been giving too much, maybe they've only been giving crumbs. Stepping down from the battle. It's like I'm, I'm stepping down. I, I give up. You know, this is, this is what I want. Wherever they've been, there's been no success. They've blocked their own success by not taking any action. But action is about to be taken. I do feel like somebody is packing up. They're going someplace. They're going someplace that is more Fertile. Good luck. 